come true gets even bigger for Lauren Hill, playing her first college basketball game in front of just a packed house. Tickets to the November 2nd game sold out in less than 30 minutes today. And WLWT News Vice Christy Davis has much more on how it all came together. One, two, three, five, 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 it's the chant inspired by Lauren Hill's perseverance. She comes out, she won't take a break. You know, obviously that's the inspiration on her part, her teammates. She just keeps battling through and trying to do every skill and every drill that we're doing out here. Coach Dan Benjamin had to make Lauren take the day off. And I told her, I said, you need to rest. We got to get you to November 2nd. We got to make this wish come through for you. After learning she had terminal brain cancer late last year, Lauren decided to stick to her commitment to play basketball for Mount St. Joe's. I was fortunate enough to know her since October of last year. And we knew at that point, talking to mom and dad and the family, that we had to do something for this girl. We believe in doing that for somebody who's special and a special player for us. They're our player. We're going to take care of them. The school worked with the NCAA to move up the date of the home opener, and Xavier University offered up the Cintas Center. The bigger facility is needed to accommodate everyone who wanted to be a part of this special moment. Associate AD for External Relations Brian Hicks said in a statement, We're excited to be a small part in making Lauren's wish come true. Lauren is as big as LeBron James today. This game sold out as fast as a recent Cavs Pacers NBA exhibition game at the Cintas Center. Lauren's coach tells us she's having a lasting impression. On and off the court. It's about getting up and doing what you can in life and enjoying what you're doing. At Mount St. Joseph's University, Christy Davis, WLWT News 5. Now, all of the proceeds from the ticket sales of this sold out game are going to go to the Cure Starts Now for Pediatric Cancer Research.